This whale of a tale involves a super sleuth named Ken Balco. He spies on killer whales in the American state of Washington using this really high-powered telescope. He also drops microphones in the water so he can hear what they're up to. Let's listen in. Yep, that's killer whale lingo. It's a very difficult language for humans to understand. Some people study it for years. Ken knows all the gang members by sight. This pod is led by a real character. Goes by the name of Granny. She may be more than 90 years old. But one morning in May, Ken encounters a very mysterious event. Suddenly, a group of porpoises start racing out of the area. Then Granny's clan heads towards shore, like they're going to swim onto the beach. Why are these marine mammals acting so crazy? Ken spots an important clue. There's a U.S. naval ship nearby, and it's sending out sonar waves. Ships use sonar to map out what's under the water. They send out a wave of sound that bounces back off objects. That's how they know what's down there. Sonar is really loud. Ouch! That hurts my ears. Ken suspects it's hurting the killer whale's ears, too. Yeah, whales have ears, even if they don't stick out from their heads like ours do. Well, like mine do, anyway. And remember their whale talk? It's how they communicate with each other. They have to have pretty sensitive ears to hear each other underwater from miles and miles away. Anyway, Ken notifies the Navy as quickly as possible, and the sonar is turned off. Phew! Great detective work by Ken and other agents has shown that sonar can really hurt whales, especially the really powerful sonar used by naval ships. When blasted with underwater noise, some whales try to get their heads out of water, and others become confused and swim in all directions. Some even swim out of the water, called stranding. That's really dangerous for the whale. The Navy is now aware that they need to be extra careful where they use sonar to protect nearby whales. So this is a case of good detective work, and it's helping out animals like Granny and her gang. Peace.